Okay, folks, we are heading into the end of the month of January, and it's mm -hmm. time to ask, how are your resolutions to get fit going? If you need a little reboot, we have just the thing for you in today's Transformation Tuesday with wellness coach Jackie Hale. Jackie says instead of being overwhelmed with good intentions, just make one smart choice every day. Jackie, that sounds simple enough, but what are we yeah. talking about specifically? So today we want to talk specifically about one big choice, and I want to challenge everyone from now until the next time I see you to eat breakfast every day if you do nothing else, right? Because oftentimes we miss breakfast and that sets our day up for disaster of snacks and not having enough. And even remember when I went through some of the food journals with you all, one of the biggest things I focused on was breakfast. So that's our challenge. All right, so let's talk about some of your suggestions for breakfast, because not only is breakfast important, but you want to eat the right thing for breakfast to really fuel your body, right? Yes, absolutely. And so I see a lot of recipes with breakfast ideas with fruits and grains and all of these things. But the part that I feel like is lacking is the protein component and a good probiotic. And so I want to offer some breakfast options that are really easy to make, that are budget friendly and that are delicious and will help your sweet tooth as well. Hmm. Yeah, that's I'm a intrigued by me. the sweet tooth part. Yeah, because yeah. <laughs> normally my go to is like a big stack of French toast, which isn't really a great way to start your morning. But tell us about this first one. This is a yogurt power bowl. So the yogurt power bowl is really delicious for a few reasons. One, the yogurt power bowl allows you the option to mix and match some things. So one thing you'll notice with all of the recipes is that there is a good protein at the base. And one cup of unsweetened low fat yogurt, you can do so much with. You can add in berries, almond slices, coconut slices. But I like this because it can be just as pretty as this photo. Or you can really just kind of say, okay, I want to mix some of these things up. I want to put them together. You can pre-make them at night you can make them so that things are easy but it's delicious with the berries and the almonds and the coconuts and budget friendly use frozen but frozen fruit you don't have to use fresh and you know what I've done that before and I have uh, Greek yogurt almost every morning but I've never thought of the coconut that intrigues me so much all right so your next one is overnight power oats what what do you mean exactly I love overnight oats. And so here's the thing, I love oatmeal. And so oatmeal is a great whole grain, but the power oat comes in the fact that we're adding protein to it. So oftentimes you'll see these great cute jars on Pinterest or something like that, where you might have oatmeal, frozen fruit, sliced almonds. Now the thing is to add a protein base to that. So you can do eight ounces of low sugar protein, you know, half a cup of egg whites. You can do a yogurt blend, add honey, cinnamon, or stevia. But the thing is you mix all of these together, and you put them in the refrigerator overnight. You might need a little bit of water for a liquid base in there, but you mix it up and you put it in the refrigerator overnight. And in the morning, it is this amazing, cool breakfast parfait. It is absolutely delicious. And so you get that nice sweet taste of, you know, all of the fruit and things together that you mix into it. But because it has that protein base and the grain and the fruit, it gives you balance for so much energy for hours. Oh, see, that's what I'm missing in the morning. I've been doing Greek yogurt right. with a little bit of honey, and it's not, and it's kind not of, enough. I'm missing the carbs. Yeah. You have to jazz that yogurt up. Yeah. You have to put some fruit in it, throw some fruit in it. It should be good. All right. And you should I feel like you're torturing yourself. Right. <laughs> I yes, am so it. glad that you've come along, Jackie, because she's going to be in a much better mood in <laughs> mornings to come. So hangry <laughs> lately. Uh, okay, so let's talk about um, a multi grain cereal power bowl. This is another bowl simple to make. Yes, another one. So the first two are something that you can put together in advance at night. The multigrain cereal bowl is one that you can even do warm, you can do cold, but it's great because it adds a different option. So you're using maybe a base of kefir um, as instead of a regular milk kefir, think of like a drinkable yogurt, but a low sugar one. It gives you a nice base of protein and an awesome probiotic. Multigrain cereal, you can do it with bananas, cinnamons, chopped almonds. I mean, anything that you can put in here, stick to the serving size of those things. And you have this great bowl that that it's not only the grains, but because you have the kefir or a yogurt or something like that, you have a good protein. So it's not just, a, you're not overwhelming your system with sugars and forcing an insulin spike. Some, you are balancing that sugar with the protein. Sometimes I feel like the nutmegs and the cinnamon, cinnamon, those spices, they trick your senses into thinking you're getting something sweet when you're really not. Absolutely, I think yeah. that's true. All right, thank you so much, Jackie.
welcome. You're welcome. So everybody, breakfast every day. Please make sure you do it. If you miss it, I'm going to send these recipes out to all the viewers in my newsletter too. All right, awesome. great. Thanks, Jackie. And a big thank you to certified sports nutrition specialist Jacqueline Hale for helping us get on track with one smart choice a day this month. So do yeah. it. And Jackie is back to add on another smart choice for us next month. So watch for more with Jackie for her next Transformation Tuesday segment right here on PTL.